As we know better, we are beginning to do better. This camp is cool and fun. You can learn a lot of stuff about the seal. The seal, the seal, oh, the crab, the cub crab. Learning is fun, and the world is one big, beautiful place that needs to be explored. Explore the ocean with Camp Sea Lab, a place where learning becomes an adventure. Welcome to Sea Lab Monterey Bay. I'm Sylvia Earle. I'm an explorer in residence at the National Geographic Society and a great friend of Sea Lab Monterey Bay. At Camp Sea Lab, we believe that students learn best by doing. Our programs, both day camp and residential, are based on national science education standards. We extend science education beyond the walls of the classroom. A ratfish! Cool! We had a surprise. We thought we were only going to catch ca crab but we caught these guys. The world's an incredibly interesting place, and Camp Sea Lab is all about letting people know that learning about the ocean is fun. Sea campers learn important science concepts with fun, hands-on activities which stimulate their minds and touch their hearts. What country is the sea in from? It gave me things to write about with something to do with science, and I had a lot of fun doing it, too. The Monterey Bay Area is home to more than 25 marine science institutions and organizations. Camp Sea Lab collaborates with many of these regional institutions to develop and deliver our programs. What better place than doing it right here in Monterey Bay? I've always said that Monterey Bay is the, space, is the Kennedy Space Center for the ocean. We have more marine institutions here than any place in the United States. We have the aquarium, we have all these incredible beaches. What a, what, what a learning laboratory. What do you guys think those are? Plankton. They are plankton. Those cocoa pods. They've got seal teeth on their tongue. Yesterday when we were kayaking in Monterey, we were looking at all kinds of neat little fish and isopods and kelp crabs and whatnot. And when we went to the aquarium, we went straight up to the kelp forest exhibit and we sat and observed for about 10 minutes. And we tried to pick out as many little camouflage creatures as we could hiding inside the kelp. And the realization that the kids were talking about, like, wow, I didn't know that was under there. Or, wow, there's so many little creatures just hiding out under there. Going over their journals to come up with 20 or 30 things about what they observed that they hadn't ever observed before. I thought it was going to be boring because I didn't know we, had, we were going to have our own room and all of that. And because I was about to, I signed up for football, but here you get to like travel to the beach and kayak and look at all the animals. So it's more like, here, please, direct me back in a picture of this. Thanks. Sea campers yeah, learn to use cutting edge technology from many of the nation's most talented marine scientists. In the process, campers are exposed to positive role models, as well as to opportunities for academic and career choices. Sea campers learn much more than science while at camp. They overcome fears, make new friends, try new experiences, and learn that they are capable of doing much more than they ever thought possible. Having such a cool roommate and it's fun and finally you get to have your own time without parents. That's probably the best thing. Exactly, he's actually exactly right. I think it's pretty cool. I'm actually planning to go to this college when I go. It was my first time on a college campus. It was my first time going kayaking. Half of me wants to go back home, but I kinda wanna stay here like another week or something. 
Well, I learned that I'm not really the person that I think I am because um, usually I think I'm like a person that that can't do a lot of things, but then um, I found out that I can actually do a lot of things. Sea campers leave camp empowered with self-confidence and inspired by knowledge. Mezclando 